The Kishuken is an ancient Japanese hunting dog breed with loyal, courageous and willful temperament. In this video, I will tell you all you need to know about the Kishuken. I would love to thank Kubo, Kertu and Yuiko for letting me use their photos in this video. If you will like the Kishuken and you would love to see more of them, definitely check them out. Links are in description. The Kishuken is the typical native Japanese breed with the spitz-like appearance. It is a medium-sized, athletic and well-muscled dog with sickle or curled tail and smaller pricked ears. This breed is officially recognized and has official breed standard under the FCI, UKC and NIPPO, which is the Japanese standard. According to all of them, accepted show colors are white, sesame and red, but the Japanese standard also recognizes the black and tan color variation. Because the demand for white colored dogs was highest, the white Kishu cans were selectively bred and today it is the most common color in the breed. The Kishuken's coat is short, straight, coarse and very dense, which helps them when hunting in harsh weather. The fur on the tail is very bushy and thick, and the breed also commonly has dense feathering on the back of its legs. The average height of the Kishuken should be between 43 to 56 cm, which is 17 to 22 inches, and the weight is typically between 14 to 27 kg, which is 30 to 60 pounds. All the native Japanese dogs are well known for their loyalty and the Kishuken is no exception. This breed is incredibly loyal and faithful to its owner. On the other hand, they are aloof and reserved with strangers, but don't worry, they shouldn't be aggressive without a reason. If you want the Kishuken as a companion dog, early proper socialization with strangers is essential. The Kishuken was used for centuries as a hunter and you should never forget about it. Hunting is natural for them and they have higher prey drive. Because of that, they might try to hunt smaller household pets, especially if they will run away from them. But they can live with other dogs in the family, especially if they are raised together from the puppyhood. The Kishuken is a smart breed, but also independent, pretty dominant and strong-willed, which is why they are not recommended for novices or unexperienced owners. They need firm and patient trainer to become obedient. This breed is an outgoing, friendly and active family companion. They create strong bond with its owner and they will want to spend as much time together as possible and they will be always ready for any outdoor adventure. The Kishuken has a very descriptive name. Kishu is describing place of origin and the word Ken can be translated to English word dog. Sometimes they can be referred to as the Kishu Inu. The word Inu also means a dog, so you can use both names, but the word but the name Kishuken is more popular. Even though the Kishuken breed was standardized and officially recognized in 1934, it is believed that this is a very ancient and native Japanese dog breed that originated from dogs that existed in Japan in ancient times. The Kishuken originated in the mountainous region of Kishu, which is located off the mainland of Japan on the southernmost island. This region is steep and full of volcanic mountains with difficult terrain. And in this area the Kishuken used to hunt large game, so it's only logical that this is a hardy, strong and endurant dog breed. Recently the popularity of Kishuken dropped drastically and they are rare even in the Japan and it's extremely hard to find them outside Japan, even though there are few breeders in foreign countries. This breed has been on the Japanese protected species list since 1934. This is a healthy and hardy dog breed with average lifespan between 11 to 14 years. Of course, just like all dogs, they can suffer from some health issues, for example from hip dysplasia or entropion. The Kishuken has a thick double coat, so they do shed, more heavily in the spring or fall. In the shedding season, regular daily brushing is recommended to remove the dead hair and minimize the shedding. Great fact is that the Kishuken does not have much of the typical doggy odor. Just like with all the dogs, you should regularly check their eyes, ears and nails and clip them or clean them if needed. Tell me in comments what do you like the most about the Kishuken and what is your experience with this dog breed. If you are new on this channel consider subscribing, turn the notifications on and check our Instagram Facebook links are in description. Thank you for watching, see you in the next video.